it may seem a, a bit crass in, in the wake of the horrific act we saw yesterday, and we've now the second time in a few weeks we've seen the beheading of an American journalist. Uh, but this is playing out in a campaign year. Uh, and uh, Scott Brown is trying to win a Senate seat in New Hampshire, the former Massachusetts senator. He has been pushing the president uh, for weeks on this issue. His Democratic opponent was one of the earliest statements yesterday, Jean Shaheen. I raise it for this point. She said very quickly yesterday after this happened, we must use every tool at our disposal, short of introducing combat ground forces in combat roles, excuse me, to put an end to the threat they pose to our national security. Scott Brown in a statement later said ISIS continues to demonstrate their inhumanity. President Obama must define a strategy to stop their murderous rampage. Is this going to be a flashpoint? Is there yesterday the statements from liberals and conservatives were all almost unanimity saying do something, do something quickly, no combat boots on the ground, and Mr. President, you need to further explain this to the American people. Will this be a campaign issue? Well, you know, the economy is still going to drive the election, but what of course also impacts the election is the president standing in the polls right. and how the country views uh, the direction it's heading and right now it appears there's a battleground poll out today that shows about 70 percent of the country views the the country going in the wrong direction right. and when you see these crises happen overseas it, it continues right. to feed that perception and that hurts the president's right. party at the polls so yes in that sense this could certainly feed into that larger narrative heading into the when, midterms. When Scott Brown was in the Senate he was never viewed as a foreign policy thinker or right. savant, a policy thinker rather. Right. Uh, but foreign policy and, and, and armed services is something that did right. motivate him when he was in the Senate. Right. And he's actually been hitting foreign policy a lot on the campaign. John McCain was up there a few right. weeks ago campaigning with him. Yeah, yeah. So this is sort of playing right into his hands. And of course the, the polls are tightening right. up in polls that state tight, yeah. as well as uh, Scott Brown also has a primary next week, September 9th.